Hey, welcome boys and girls to our Christmas assembly here in St. Shocknell's National School. And I've heard about all the great work from the elves and the teachers that you have been doing in your classrooms this year. So well done, boys and girls. It's only eight more sleeps to Christmas and I'm so excited. Hello, hello, hello. Boys and girls, did you just see something on my screen? Hello, hello, hello. Am I on mute? Santa, Santa, is that you? I hope you can all see me. I hope you can all hear me. I'm getting really good at Zooming, boys and girls. And right now I'm zooming in to all the boys and girls in St. Chaplin's National School in Dunchaplin. Of course, I'm used to zooming in to see you all in a different way. I love to zoom in by helicopter. I've landed in your football pitch and I've been able to spend the whole day chatting to you and hearing your songs and poems, listening to playing your tin whistles, having a cup of tea and mince pie with your teachers. It has been a funny year. We are all, you know, know about the coronavirus and we want to keep everybody safe. And we're doing very little visiting these days. It's been very hard work, hasn't it? I've been hearing such great reports from St. Chapman's School. Mrs. Whelan is touch me very often and she tells me that you're doing your best to follow the new rules. Santa has to follow the new rules too. And unfortunately, that means I can't come to your school to see you this year. But I'm so happy that I can talk to you on Zoom and see you all in your classrooms with your teachers. Santa, we are so delighted that you came to visit us on Zoom today for our Christmas assembly. Only last week, Santa, we made a little video with some questions that we wanted to ask you. Let me see if I can find them, Santa. Santa, here they are. How are you doing, Santa, during this virus? I hope you're okay. Hello, I am very well. Thank you for asking. We are all very good up in the North Pole here and nobody got the virus because we didn't go anywhere. We're all in a bubble and nobody came to visit us. So we are all very well. Thank you very much. Santa, are you going to come to people's houses this year? Hello, how are you? Thank you for asking. And the answer is yes, I am going to everybody's house the same as last year. So don't forget to be very good and I will be there Christmas Eve. Uh, are your elves in the North Pole helping you with the presents? Do they have to social distance and wear masks? Hello, well, the answer to your question is uh, no, the elves don't wear a mask. I don't wear a mask. But don't forget, we are all in one big bubble here and nobody has come to visit us. Thank you for asking. Santa, why did you send Lazy Lucy to our class in last year and this year? Because sometimes she can be very naughty. Thank you for asking. I, I sent the elf because we like to keep an eye on everybody and just see that they're behaving themselves and being very good. Bye bye. Santa, what have you been doing all the lockdown? Well, the lockdown has been much the same up here, you know. We're all in a big bubble and we're doing the very same thing as we always did. Thank you. Bye-bye. Santa, is Mrs. Claus okay and are the rangers okay? Mrs. Claus and the elves are all very well. I will tell them you are asking. Thank you very much. Santa, how do the elves fly? Because I checked mine this morning and there's no evidence of that it could fly. Do you decorate the tree, Santa Claus? Santa Claus, how hard does your sleigh fly? Santa, why did Rudolph have a red nose and the other reindeer don't? Santa, how does your reindeer fly? Hi Santa, what's your favourite colour? Well, we use magic dust for the, for the reindeer and the sleigh and everything to fly. Do you decorate a tree, Santa Claus? Yes, we do decorate a tree. In actual fact, we have lots of big ones here and we decorate a whole lot of them. Thank you. Santa, why did Rudolph have a red nose and the other reindeer don't? 
Rudolph has a re has a red nose because we only really need one reindeer to have a have a red nose be on a foggy maybe a foggy Christmas Eve. Hi Santa, what's your favourite colour? You want to know my favourite colour? Can you not guess? It's red. Just have a look at my suit. Santa, how did the elves fly? Because I checked mine this morning and there's no evidence of that it could fly. Well, we use magic dust for the for the reindeer and the sleigh and everything to fly. Santa, what do you want us to leave out on this Christmas Eve? Hello. Well, you can leave me out something nice. I don't mind uh, what you leave really, but maybe a little bit of mince pies or cookies or something like that. Because how high does your sleigh fly? You want to know how high we fly? Well, we more or less fly about the same as an aeroplane. Santa, thank you so much for answering all our questions. 2020 has been such a difficult year for all the boys and girls in Dunshockland. And we really hope that you will be able to visit us on Christmas Eve. I heard that some of you are very worried and People have not been able to travel to be with their families and not been able to visit their grannies and granddads. Some of you are very worried that I would not be able to come leave the North Pole. And well, I have some very good news for you. Minister Simon Coveney has given me special permission to fly into Irish airspace on Christmas Eve. I will be extra careful and I will sanitize my hands before and after I leave your house. Santa, I'm going to leave some cookies and milk and some carrots for Rudolph. And I'm also going to put some hands on a tiger for you. Santa, you're the best. We all love you. You're the best in the world. Thank you for giving us all the presents in every year. Thank you. Bye. Well, the elves have been very busy. They have been working overtime for the last few weeks, doing the best to make sure everything is ready on time, using special sanitizer on the ties to make them safe. I must remember to, to give them some extra time off after Christmas. I heard that there is a very important football match this weekend. The very best of luck to Miss O'Sullivan and. I will be cheering for me and wearing my green and gold instead of my usual red. Well, boys and girls, there's no doubt that I'm very disappointed I can't come to Dunchocklin to see you all this year. But I'm really glad I was able to have this quick chat with you. I have sent some very special treats for you using my Christmas magic. They are outside your classroom door. I'm looking forward to zooming in to all your houses on Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! Oh my goodness, boys and girls. I can't believe that Santa just came to visit us live on Zoom. Teachers, you better go and check outside the door and see if Santa left any surprises. Boys and girls, we're going to have to leave this Christmas assembly for another time. <laughs>